going on? It's your girl Fathom DJ in the building. I am here. It's been a while since I did a review of a piece of equipment. So I'm updating my YouTube channel and I am featuring today the Yamaha MG06X. It is a very small mixer. I'm adding it to my PA system for DJing as well as music instruments and uh, vocalist. Um, I have the Vestax 300 MK2 DJ controller and I've had it for five years. There is a review of this controller on my channel as well. What's on the back of the Vestax is two RCA outs, two quarter inch outs, and one RCA, two RCA, well one RCA in left and right through, which allows you to be able to plug in other devices. CDJs, turntables, laptop, whatever other device you wanna plug in audio wise. You do have the capability on this DJ controller to be able to plug stuff in and take the controller straight out to your PA system. I don't feel very comfortable with that. <laughs> so what I do is I would normally bring out my DJ mixer and it's an old Pioneer and it's huge and heavy. So I decided to buy a smaller mixer to be able to carry. It's light, it's clean, it sounds great, it's got effects on it and that is the Yamaha MG06X. I used it on Saturday for a small event that I was doing and I was really impressed with the warmth the sound quality, the echoes, the uh, the effects in general, and its portability. So that's this mixer. I paid 103 bucks for it on eBay, um, and it was used. Um, shipping included, box, instructions. Love this mixer. Two channels with a full EQ, effects in and out a mono and stereo on both quarter inch jacks that means there are six options for input xlr there's a hybrid xlr two quarter inch jack that you can simply plug things into as many things as you want to plug into it rca um, and of course ipad what have you you can plug whatever you need to plug in, drum pads, drum machines, effects, whatever you want to plug in. I think you have enough inputs on this device to be able to do that. And of course, my favorite thing on it is the effects section. This is assigned to one and two on the mixer console. It has phantom power, which to me gives a little more warmth and depth to the sound. I am in delay, so the button is punched in and I am in long. The volume button or the volume knob allows you to lose the effects or add them and make them louder. <laughs> it's my favorite. Of course, there's a short on top and it makes it a little shorter and you can still kind of hear the effects, but they're shorter shorter closer to your voice and of course on the other end there's a vo and that's even shorter than that and you can still kind of hear it it's it's warm and i like the side so on the other side there's a reverb at the bottom there's plate and you can tell it's full if i go to room it opens up the room just a little bit and if i go to hall it gets very deep and long just like a hallway mic so, and of course, you can lose all of the vo the e echoes and the effects if you punch out of effects on these channels, one and two. Um, so we're gonna turn it down and I'm gonna come out. This mixer, in my opinion, is a steal of a deal, specifically because you have the opportunity as a vocalist 
who's traveling. Uh, I had a conversation with a, with a, a vocalist, and I suggested that they get their own mics and maybe their own mixing board, mixing console, just in case the club that you're working at does not have proper equipment. You're coming in. You can help with your sound. You can tweak it so that your levels are the way that you want them. Sound check goes well. Your performance is going to be off the chain, and you're going to look that be looked at as extra professional. Um, a keyboardist, a guitarist, or what have you. I know they're smaller devices, but just in case you need to add more things, you have the option to add more things in this tiny mixer, and you have two possibilities for outs. So if you need to run a DJ uh, monitor closer to you and two PA speakers from it, a woofer, what have you, you can totally come out of these three inputs or outputs on the device. And of course it has a headphone jack so you can monitor everything on here if you need to. I think it's an awesome purchase. Um, and I'm back. I'm here to continue to inspire. I'm here to continue to brand myself. I'm here to continue legacy for those aspiring to be professional, for those aspiring to um, get their rates and get their due. When you have a pro professional equipment, when you brand yourself and market yourself, you get an opportunity to get more opportunities that are in your lane. We need to be very definitive about marketing and promoting ourselves and what we bring to the table as DJs so people see that you're not just a hobbyist or a novelist. And that's part of the reason why I'm doing um, this newer series of videos. My channel is going to start to pop again. I've got a lot of original production that's going to be put out, a lot of marketing tools that we'll be putting into place. And I am here to inspire while aspiring. Once again, Fathom DJ in the building, giving a shout out to Victor Salazar for encouraging me to return to my YouTube channel. I'm on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, Mixcloud, LinkedIn, Google Fathom DJ, and hopefully you will find something that inspires you to continue your music and artistry or what have you um, as I make my way through uh, my journey in terms of music, art, and all things Fathom DJ. Space.